CS50 artificial intelligence um, is called Minesweeper uh, problem set. So we're gonna see what it will look like to run this game. So um, we click on AI move um, because it's non safe move. So we right pick one one and it's lost. We reset that and we make uh, another one this is say no run, uh, no safe move make a random move and no safe move make a random move and they can um, AI can make a safe move right oh we lost because there is no safe no non safe to make a random move a random move there is a risk we lost the game so there's a risk that there is nine we lost the game so we said it again all of them are safe move right now okay we win this uh, we win this one uh, we said play it again all of them are safe moves right now Okay, we want to get. So, how do we uh, implement a AI code for this game? Right. So, uh, the basic logic behind this is like um, the number uh, means this cell is safe, and uh, among its neighbor means uh, the up, down, left, and right, and diagonal cells. Among all of them, there is one. There is one mine. Right. So this is the basic logic among all these games. So um, we can see the code, um, the code in here. So one, the part that we implement is sentence, sentence. Um, so this non mine is like, a, do we know these cells are mine? Uh, if this, we know these cells are mine, so how do we know that if the count of the cells and the length of the cells uh, are equal, means like if there are three cells, and all of them are mine, so we can just you know represent all of the cells are mine. And if um, there's a set of cells and none of them are mine, so we can represent all of them are safe. And how do we uh, in these two sentences, these two uh, function, which is you know update the internal knowledge representation of that. If we remove this known status cells, um, how do we renown our sentence? Like uh, if we pop this up. And uh, if you know something as mine, and we just you know remove that from the sentence and count minus one. And if you know that that's safe, we just remove them. Uh, we don't, and the count doesn't change. And uh, for the uh, Minesweep AI class, what we do is acknowledge. Acknowledge. So when we will use acknowledge is that when we like have a, have a click on a new. A safe cells and we know this number like among the neighbor cells there are how many of mines among the neighbor cells so the first thing we is, is move uh, we mark this moves and we mark this cells as safe and also we need to represent the neighbor cells of these cells right we need to represent that uh, how do we do that it's like uh, for this next to that right plus uh, minus one minus one right minus one and uh, also we have to make sure that uh, it's among the board range so this one doesn't come because it's out, outside of the range and uh, for this this the sentence is just that and we just make a cell and we add to the neighbor cells and we have to remove the cell itself because it's not a neighbor of this cell, right? And uh, for this one, we have to make sure that uh, all of the neighbor cells are the the status is undetermined. It's not known safe or known mine. We have to if it's uh, already in the mine, we have to remove that and count minus one. If it's already in the saves, we have to remove that. And then we add that sentence. We make a new sentence with that knowledge, and we add that append that to our self knowledge um, list. So we have some new knowledge in here, and we just based on that 
we can infer, we can just know, like, uh, loop through our knowledge and say, uh, do we know for sure that certain cells are safe or certain cells are mine, right? So this just do that. And this part is that we make some inference, like, uh, how do we do that? It's like, uh, if the count is zero, so all of them are safe, right? If the count equals the length, then all of them are mine, right? And this part is like we where we made some inferences like uh, based on the certain already all of the uh, sentences we know can we infer some new sentences? How do we do that? Is like uh, is certain sentences is a subset of certain sentences? If if so, we just you know minus them and minus the count to generate the new sentences. Um, so um, we have to rule out the possibility that the two sentences are the same. And the possibility that the some sentences are an empty, empty one. So because the empty set is the subset of every all of the every uh, sentence set. So we have the room out these three circumstances, and for these two, we just you know minus them. Uh, if this is subset for this, we just minus them, and we have to make sure that this new sentence is not already in the knowledge base of ourselves. And if so, we just append these new sentences to the knowledge. So these all are the uh, inferences we make. So make sense move, that means like a uh, amount, all of the board cells, uh, and uh, we should pick a, um, we should pick a, a, we should pick a one that not already made move, right? Amount of them, we should pick one that already clicked on. So not in the move made, and we have to choose from our knowledge that we know for sure that this cell are safe. So there's a safe move, and we, then we return that. And then we return that. And for when we don't have any safe move to make, we can make a random move. And uh, so this is not in the, make sure it's not in the move already made, and make sure it's not what we know as mine, right? So, which is nowadays, and we can return a random loop. So uh, that's all for this project. Thank you for listening.